Okay, so we are getting ready to do our vision boards, and you guys seen in the previous video that I bought some big poster boards from the Dollar Tree. If usually in like previous years they had like a four pack of mini poster boards, but they didn't have those this year, so I bought the big ones. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut them down the hat like in half so they could be smaller. Um, I'm going to make one, Becky's going to make one, Sophie's going to make one, and Rhea's going to make one. So um, first things first is to cut these and make them just like half the size. If you want to do a big vision board like this, you could, um, but I like to keep mine. Um, I like to keep mine right here on the side of the fridge. Um, you're going to want to keep your vision board somewhere where you're going to see it, see it daily. So you're going to look at your goals. And All right, guys. Sorry, today was here washing day, so I just jumped out of the shower and I'm letting my hair dry but um so the thing is with your vision board is you're going to want to go ahead and keep those somewhere where you're going to see them some people keep them in their office uh, maybe right there in front of their bed so it's the first thing they see at, in the morning and the last thing they see at night I keep mine right here on my fridge because I spend so much time in my kitchen and my house is rather small so I'm always in this room so I always see it I'm always watching it I'm always looking at it also, mindset. Don't start this process right now of making these vision boards when you're yelling at your kids, fighting with your husband, in a bad mood. Like, you're going to have to distrust. Take a shower, take a bath, you know, have a cup of tea, whatever, have a little cocktail. Really decompress, and you're going to want to focus. You're going to want to have a clean, fresh perspective, be in a positive mood, play a little bit of mood music if you want. I don't know. I'm probably going to pick something because the kids will pick, like, Harry Styles or something. Um... And just have some music playing in the background just to be real calm. And I want you guys to literally act like you are, the universe is handing you a big catalog. And they're like, all right, here's your catalog. Go through. What do you want? And I want you to just go big. Don't limit yourself. Don't be like, oh, that's too much. That's unrealistic. Because I did that before. And I was like, oh, I don't want to ask for that much because that's never going to happen. Let me tape. No. Do not limit yourself. Because if you're already starting it out with this negative mindset that oh, it's probably not going to happen. I'm going to ask. It, it's just going to ruin the vibe. Okay. Go big, go big or go home. Everything you want, lay it out there. And when you're, when you're putting these things out there, just think of it. It's happening. It's coming. How excited you're going to be. Live in that moment. Like this is it. Oh my God. When I make this money, I'm going to be so happy. I'm going to buy this. I'm going to take my kids here. I'm going to update this. Or when I send in that last check to that credit card, Oh my God, the excitement, or when I pay off that student loan, or when I get that car, and imagine yourself driving in the car with the windows down, your hair blowing in the breeze, and just being the baddest on the block. Think of it. Get excited. Get that that gut feeling of excitement, of just knowing, just that feeling of knowing something wonderful is coming to you, because it is. And that's the purpose of the vision board. That is generally the purpose of law of attraction, is like attracts the like. You know what I mean? What you want, it's, it's out there. You just got to know that it's coming to you. Ask, believe, receive. If you guys have not read um, Law, uh, what is it called? Um, I think it's called The Magic or I can't think of it now. There's so many Law of Attraction books, uh, but they, they really go into it. There's people here on YouTube that um, have really great like series where they talk about Law of Attraction. And if you have like a thing where you're like, and it doesn't necessarily have to be the universe. It could be whoever you pray for. It's who you make it out of. And it's, it's, it's real. It's real. And the more you read into it, the more it's like, yeah. Like how do rich people file bankruptcy, but they still stay rich because they already know more money's coming to them. All right. So um, get your stuff. We you get some pens. We got our, we got our boards. If you guys have magazines, get all those together. If you guys are going to print out some stuff on the, um, off the internet, do that. We have a bunch of stickers. I don't print out anything or do magazine cutouts. I literally just make lists and I just, just write everything down, write everything down. Um, for example, this year, I, I know what I want each month's monthly income to be. I'm going to put that down. I'm not going to specifically show you guys what I write down. I'll probably show you with your kids because I feel like it's personal, you know, um, but that's just me. Um, I have, you know, things that I want to have done around the house. I want to take my girls on vacation this year. Um, I have a size pair of pants that I want to fit into. Like this year, I'm going to fit into a size nine jean, period. Um... Just things like that. And guys, I'm telling you right now, my mood, if you can't even tell, is so pumped. I'm so excited. I am ready. 
ready, ready. And don't let any of the negative surroundings impact you right now. Don't let any of that stuff. If you have to sage, if you have to do go pray, anything, do that before you start this. All right, let's go. All right, so the girls have their boards. They all opted to go with the white boards. So we have um, some alphabet letters, okay? So you guys can do that. Well, I'm going to show you what you guys have. This one I actually got from myself. Um, we got some numbers, and you can color these numbers. Girls, are you guys listening before you start fighting? We're not fighting. We're going to be positive, okay? Positive vibes. No fighting. No fighting. Um, we got some of these stickers. Is Benny in his cage? Yeah. Go let him out, guys. It's the best it's oh. So we got some of these stickers. Guys, just... Here, I specifically got those ones for you. We got tons of stickers. These are all from the Dollar Tree. Um, you can probably find them at Walmart, Michaels. I just like the Dollar Tree because they're cheaper, but Walmart may have something cheaper too. So um, to each its own. But we got all the things here. And you guys are going to start? Yes. Start making your boards. Are you excited? Oh my God, I look so bad. Are you guys excited? Yes. Are you guys manifesting greatness for 2021? Yes. Yep. Period. Manifestation. Yes. How about you, Becky? You attract the vibes that you were put out to the Absolutely. All right. So let me ask you guys this. What is the what is your mood right now going into making these boards? Are you pumped? Are you excited? excited. You're excited? How about you, Soph? Are you just like excited to put them out and just to what are you feeling? You don't know. Sophie is the quiet one. How about you, Ray? What's your vibe? I'm trying to go with no vibe. Just Anything. Open, open anything. You know, I'm positive. But I don't want anything to go into it because I don't know what to expect, you know? Yeah. Like you're taught us that at home. It's just like you can't expect anything. Really All right. You go on that side, baby. But that's okay. You can do whatever size you want. We have extra. We two sides. Okay. So. We could do, but you only want to do one because that side's going to hang up, okay? All right. Take your stickers. All right. So here's mom's. I don't know if this is, I might have to cut this, but just be creative. That's that's kind of the the name of it, huh? No, we're not gonna do dance moms because Abby yells too much in the background. She does. She does, but all right. So I'm just gonna start doing some stickers. Let's do that. Seen you clearer than now. We're flying high, floating somewhere up in the clouds. We're going out of ourselves. Can you feel it? Almost like I don't know if it's real. Cause when we're doing our thing, we're the wheels that won't stop turning. So take me on a trip, 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 nah, trip, trip, trip. Oh, I flick the switch, kill the lights. Oh, I wasted. City lights are shining so bright All these empty faces We don't care about them tonight We're going out of ourselves, can you feel it? Almost like I don't know if it's real Cause when we're doing our thing with the wheels Don't stop turning I know we're acting stupid It's about traveling, it's about your personal life, it's you about your physical. Oh, yeah. I We're traveling. I'm putting it out. Yeah, because. Me too. So, here's what this is what I have so far because I always mess this up, but I'm just putting it to something I like a to do list. Hi. Mm -hmm. And what I want to do. Okay. All right, guys, so here's mine. I'm pretty much done. Sophie's still working on hers, you can see. Becky, are you almost done or are you still going? Still going. How about you, Ray? Jeez. Raya. Raya. Are you still going or are you done? I'm done. All right, so we'll go over mine and Rhea's real quick. So this is mine. Um, it just says my name on there. I did it with the stickers, and then I left the number stickers for the kids. Um, so I just wrote out 2021. Said I wanted to build an empire. I wanted to ha um, have at least stable 5K in my savings all the time. 
fit into a size 9 jeans. So for Instagram, I have a couple things, uh, just secure more flowers. I want to get at least 5K on TikTok, which I'm still even working. I have this each, each day I write the story of my life, um, best physical and mental health. Um, I want to be invited to social media events. I think that would be cool. I want to finish my basement. I want to take down the separation wall and upgrade my landscape outside. Um, I want to work with Casetify. We have to get a new car because Ray is getting Leo's. So uh, we're going to get a new truck. I'm hoping for a new truck anyways. Um, I would love to work with Savage Fenty. I have another um, Dyson I have on here. And then I had some goals for YouTube. Um, I really want my Chicago uh, Killer Series to go viral. That's like my big thing. I would love to hit 100K this year and to uh, make a certain amount of money. And then what else? Have a huge party after COVID. I would love to grow my customers for my nails and maybe secure um, like some steady people and you know really turn that into something. Um, let's see, paying cash always. And then I have this little mantra: ching 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 goes a money tree. Every time it chings, money comes to me. Top left, right, and up under me. Wave wave wave. I'm a money wave. Money flow, money flow, money made. Um, flowing in and out plus all money saved debt 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 all debt is paid so um, just little things that you know are important to me and what I want to grow and what I want to do again I put like my mental health my physical health you know fitting to certain prior size jeans I didn't want to put a number of a, of a weight that I wanted I just want to say I want to fit into a size 9 jeans this year and I will um, you know doing more fashion content. I think that would be really fun. And yeah, make sure I have some money in the savings, make sure that we have zero debt and continue that this year. Always paying in cash. We did that last year and I want to continue that. And just really grow on social media, grow all my platforms, um, take my kids on a vacation, um, make sure I get to see all my family now when COVID's over because I miss everybody and I would love to just have like a huge um, party. Again, like I would love to... Um, really have like my own business of like doing nails and stuff like that and I would love to come out with like um maybe some of my own polishes and stuff like that I think that would be really fun so just things I'm thinking about um and that's gonna be like the way I build my empire you know um I would love to do an ebook this year too I'm gonna throw that on there but this is basically how it is and then I'll put it up which one healthy healthy h e a so let's go look at you finish yours up and then we'll look at Rhea's all right Ray you can show them as much or as little as you want Rhea you want to show them as much as or as little as you want let's see what hers looks like you can show, you can show, oh, let me take out my stuff. all right so go ahead and, and tell them so Rhea's 2021 her junior year that's what she's gonna be going into yeah. so um all right what do you got um, this is a bunch of just school stuff, so like, like tests to take and everything, and then stuff. Well, tell them. Let's put it all out there, girl. Okay, so I want to get all A's and the minimum 1B, which would keep my GPA where it, at, where it is. Pass my AP exam for my psychology class and get a 4. Take the PSAT, and then I get 1250 on that. Take the PACT, and I get 25 on that. Bring it a tournament for speech and get 4th, which would like be awesome. Get to state for speech and then join the National Honor Society at my school. Okay, what else? Vacation, anywhere. I literally don't care as long as we get to go on one. Okay. Um, do something I never thought I'd do and surprise myself. Like Be kind of the person that I end up becoming happy, healthy, successful, and proud and don't doubt myself and just do it. Amen, sis. Start planning my trip to Ireland with Papa. My dad's taking her to Ireland after her senior year. They've been planning this for years. Yeah. Redo the bedroom in the basement. See Love on tour, which is Harry Styles. And then get 10k on TikTok. Okay, what um, else? Take my ancestry mm -hmm. test so I can see where I'm from. Get my license, change my last name, get the internship so that the internships that I want. Get a job, preferably Starbucks, and then a relationship would be nice. Um, not trying to put it out there, but I, I wouldn't hate it. And okay, then, that sounds good, babe. You did a really nice job. So where are you going to hang yours at? Just on my my bedroom. I don't know. Got to have it somewhere where you could see it. All right, Becky, you finished? No, I have one more thing. One more thing? How about you, Soph? You ready or you want to take a break? Um, I don't know. Are you ready? You don't, we're not rushing you. Are you. If you want to take a few more minutes? Yeah. Okay, we'll be back. Okay. All right, here's Becky's. All right, Becky, so go ahead and tell them. What does your stuff say? I put 2020 my name. Um, 
I would, I'm be good in first grade. Mm -hmm. Um, go to gymnastics. Mm -hmm. Be good in gymnastics. Mm -hmm. Always be healthy. Yeah. Love all my family. Mm -hmm. Excited to be eight. You're gonna be eight. Yep. Yeah. Um, be good at roller skating. Yeah. What does this say about Harry Styles? Meet him. Oh, then what is this? She wants to meet Harry Styles. And who does this say? That you love Papa, you love Mom, you love Dad, you love Aunt, Aunt Ree, and you love your family. That's so nice. And you want to go to the beach? Mm -hmm. Wow, you did a wonderful job. So you can tell our friends Happy New Year? Happy New Year. Yeah, Happy New Year. Was this a fun little activity? Mm -hmm. Yeah, set you up, get you ready for... The new year, right? I'm gonna write my name off the back. Oh, you don't have to, baby, because it's gonna get all, all this stuff is gonna get all over the other side. So just leave it just like that, okay? Okay. Okay. All right, so my Sophie is the uh, the quiet type. So she said I can read it to you guys. Um, so she has her 2021. She's gonna be 12 years old. There's her name, Sophia. She says for her grades, she wants to get good grades, going to junior high, junior high, better grades. Um, in writing, better grades in math, fight gender norms, that's a good one, Sophie. Um, make two more friends, get better at being social, and be more social. She wants to join volleyball, and I think this would be really great to help you, Sophie, join the volleyball club. She wants to join the anime sketch club, the video, video game club, and get more cosplay things, and learn to skate, like roller skate or skateboard? Skateboard. That's cool. Um, for art, she, Sophie's a very good artist. She wants to improve at her art, get more art supplies, and submit a picture to a magazine. And she just wants to draw more and have decent grades for 2021. I think that's awesome. So we're going to tell them, Happy New Year, friends. Happy New Year. Thank you for hanging out with us. And hopefully this gives you guys some ideas on what to do, if, even if it's just something fun to do with the kids. So we love you, and we hope that your 2021 was a lot better than 2020. I don't think it'll be too hard. But thank you guys so much, and we'll see you all in the next one. Take it easy, friends.